Big developments tonight involving two local men arrested during the crisis at the Capitol, both facing charges, including one federally. Our Charlie DeMar is live at the Dirksen Federal Building, and Charlie, no regrets for one Trump supporter. Murray, David Fitzgerald was picked up on curfew violations in D.C. He spent a night locked up. He returned back to his home in Roselle today. He says he doesn't like what he saw in D.C., but he has no regrets. There's a curfew, you're under arrest. David Fitzgerald from suburban Roselle live streamed his day in D.C. Even his arrest booked for breaking the 6 p.m. curfew, and he was on federal property. Unfortunately, I got arrested. Like, okay, yeah, I was guilty of curfew violation. Okay, I'm a sinner, you know. Fitzgerald says he didn't go inside the Capitol, but he was a couple hundred feet away from the violent chaos. We could see the Capitol, and we're like, are people climbing that? And they were. I know what happened. I saw people in there. That's not good. We even heard so many people died. I'm like, what? Do you have any regrets about the whole thing? No. And why not? What would I regret? Brad Rixalis from Inverness also arrested in the siege of the Capitol. He now faces federal charges for storming the building. He even admitted to roaming the halls in an exclusive interview with CBS2. Were you inside the Capitol? Um, I was. It turned into to chaos. Tonight, Ruxalis was fired from his job as CEO of suburban-based tech company Cogencia. I had nothing to do with charging anybody or anything or any you know, any of that. I was, I was in a, the wrong place at the wrong time, and, I, and I, I regret my part in that. Prosecutors say nothing is off the table when it comes to elevating charges for those arrested. Upgrade my charges to whatever you want. I know what I did. I know what I didn't do. Police reports from Fitzgerald's arrest say that police asked him three times to leave the grounds and he did not. And that is when he was arrested. He pled not guilty. Reporting from Federal Plaza, Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. Marie. Charlie, thank you.